Hello again everybody, it's Jennifer with creativecricketdesigns.blogspot.com and today we're going to be doing another Disney layout from the trip to Florida that my family took and we are working on the Goofy and Pluto. It's a two page layout, I have some 12 by 12 cardstock, um, two pieces and we're just going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to start on the left which is going to be the Goofy page I have a piece of black cardstock which measures eight and a quarter by eleven and a quarter, and then the pattern paper is eight by eleven. And this pattern paper is from the Audrey cartridge. Um, it's a Cricut Imagine cartridge, so I pulled it off of there. And we're gonna go ahead and get this layered on here. I also did some white stitching on it, some faux stitching. Well, I did it, it's um, a line and a dash, a line and a dash, and I went around all of the um, layers on everything. So I have Goofy Signature, which I think is going to go here, but I just want to lay it out first. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put this picture of Michaela and Goofy down. So I'm going to make sure that I can put it all back on there how I had it laid out. Like so, and then the signature will go at the bottom. have my title. This is Goofy and this is from, all the cuts are from the Disney Mickey and Friends cartridge and this is cut at two and a half inches in all of its later and I, layers and I also use the um, shadow. I have this on some pop dots so we're going to go ahead and remove the backing and get this applied. Like that. And then I have Goofy who's going to go right there and I'm going to go ahead and adhere him right to the page and I'm just going to use my ATG gun right like that and then we're going to move to the right side of the page which is going to be Pluto and um, Goofy is cut at seven and a quarter inches my photo mats. Uh, this one is four by six, and the photo or the mat is four and a quarter by six and a quarter, and the picture is four by six. And this one, I just kind of cut around the signature and matted it to fit um, the autograph. So on this one, I have the icon and icon border of the dog bones for Pluto, and. That's something that I added after I had created this in my Gypsy, so let me find it for you here. It's the icon border, which is on page 84. So I did this and then the shift, and I created it in my Gypsy, and I welded them together. And I can get you those measurements um, on here when the video is done. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get this adhered. I'm going to see if I can use this. And when I did it in my Gypsy, when I welded it together, it wasn't, it's not a perfect, perfect match, but it works for me. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, work with it here. Oops. I want this at the top of the page. And then I have another mat, which is, uh, let's see, I think it is six by eleven and a half, or six and a quarter. The black mat is six and a quarter by eleven and a half, and then the um, pattern paper is six by eleven and a quarter. So we're gonna go ahead and get that in here done. Oops. 
the two pic uh, picture and then the autograph. I'm going to go ahead and get the autograph down. And then the photo. And then um, I chose the black in the blue to kind of go with um, this and then the background because I know there's black in both of the characters. So that's why I chose those colors. And then I have Bluto who's going to go right here. He is cut from page um, 85 and I cut him at five and a half inches. So he will be right there and then Got it. Get an angle on here just right so I can fit um, the title on here. So I have the title is up on Pop Dot, and the title is cut at two and one quarter inches, and all of its layers, including the shadow, which is the black piece. So that's going to go right there, and then I'm going to uh, use my mono adhesive to get him onto the page. And he's going to go just like that. And I'm not going to worry about the tail adhering that down because it's going to go into a scrapbook layout or into an album. So this is the completed layout for Goofy and Pluto. I'll do a run through real quick. Um, I have the Goofy title is cut at two and a half inches on page 94. Goofy is cut at seven and a quarter inches at on page ninety-five. Pluto title is cut at two and a quarter inches from, from page eighty-four. And Pluto is cut at five and a half inches on page eighty-five. So I thank you very much for watching and have a great day.